morning. We are in uh, Columbus, Mississippi. Uh, we ate barbecue last night for dinner, which we are all hoping feels us very well uh, today in the tradition of Southern cycling. We're going to be riding 105 miles to Meridian, Mississippi today, which is the home of PV amplifiers if you're in the rock and roll business. It's a major thing, particularly if you love 38 Special, who endorsed PV from their first day. <laughs> Um, the first guitar amplifier I ever had was a PV Bandit, which was amazing. And uh, Meridian is also a very special place in the history of, uh, of the blues, which we'll, we'll uh, learn when we get there. Um, our two dedications today uh, are to Quinn O'Shea, who is the nephew of our good friend Jim Lehman. Uh, Jim is a, is a cycling coach. Uh, with Carmichael Training Systems in Colorado, and uh, Kurt and Chad, who, who are uh, have been with us on every year of Pop Love Across America, are very close with him as am I. And uh, Jim was going to do this ride, wasn't able to due to scheduling conflicts. And um, about eight weeks ago, he uh, called me and told me this this unbelievable. Um, uh, news that his nephew in Seattle had uh, cancer in his eye. Um, so for Jim, he was supporting the Pablo Foundation as a friend and and has been behind us as a friend. He did not have cancer uh, in his life and then two months ago it came crashing in on him. Um, Quinn is two and a half years old and he loves uh, to swim, he loves animals, and uh, he loves of course uh, the Seattle Sounders. Um, soccer, which is a good thing to love because they're an awesome team. Uh, so we're sending a very special, um, we're sending a very special hug out to Quinn through this video. Um, John Bennett, who's over here, who's uh, our, my fellow three-week rider, and he's on the board of the Pablo Foundation. He uh, is from Seattle, and as soon as Jim called me, John connected. Quinn's dad, and uh, you know we made that Pavlov connection the best way that we could. Um, our second dedication is to Cannon McKee, who is six years old, and is from Mount Vernon, Illinois, which is a town that we passed through uh, earlier in this ride. Uh, we just missed those guys. I think they were out of town when we were there, and uh, Cannon has surgery tomorrow, so um, we're going to be holding Cannon very close in our hearts today as we ride. Uh, Cannon rides. He's bike every day because of Pop Love Across America. He's six years old. Uh, many of the people on this ride have kids who are six years old or around six years old or who have been six years old. We all know what a special age that is. Uh, when uh, a little boy starts to become like an adolescent boy and starts to have opinions and starts to have a little attitude and wants to get on a bike and pedal faster than everybody else and and it's just on the verge of like wanting to do things on their own and we're really really pleased that Cannon has caught the cycling bug from Pablo Across America it's really an amazing thing uh, we were talking last night at dinner about Haracha's uh, special bond with with my son Pablo Haracha owns Velo Pasadena um, which is the best bike shop in the LA area and when I first went into Velo Pasadena as a guy who knew very little about cycling um, as a friend of a friend of Haracha's he treated Pablo and I like family from the first moment we met him and um, Pablo would always jump on little kid bikes in the shop and ride around and <laughs> a few times he may have run over people's toes or may have come very close but Raj always uh, let him do his thing, and and uh, we still have the two bikes that, that Raj gave to Pablo in our garage. They were both uh, specialized uh, BMX bikes. One is one is maroon or blood red, and the other one is blue, and uh, very special. Um, it's a very special thing for a, a parent to see their child get the cycling bug and I will say as a father of a little boy very special to see my little boy get into cycling and, and really love the thrill of the uh, sprint at the end of a cycling stage on television or in person and to have the thrill of wanting to kick his dad's butt on a bike which I can assure you Pablo always did so uh, from us uh, out here in Columbus Mississippi we're sending love off to you guys wherever you are thank you for following us um, we, we 
really means a lot to us, all of your YouTube comments, all of your Facebook comments, and uh, we, are, uh, we are all hitting our fundraising pages as hard as we can right now in the last few days. We'll be in New Orleans on Friday, and uh, between now and then we've got hundreds of miles to roll, 105 miles today. It's not easy, uh, especially with all the, all the rolling hills that we hit and uh, especially when it's cold in the morning and then it gets to be brutally hot by the mid middle of the day. But we're doing it for the kids and the parents who are on the front lines of pediatric cancer. Pablo Across America 2011. See you later.